This tutorial is to discuss a Python program to find a user input number is palindrome or not using a function. The function definition starts with a keyword def followed by the function name. The name of the function used is is palindrome. The function takes one parameter. The name of the parameter is n. The function definition starts with a keyword colon. Before finding the reverse of a number, the actual number gets stored into a variable which is named as num. It is used to preserve the value of n because while finding the reverse of a number, the actual number will drop to 0 as per the logic which we have written. We use a while loop for finding the reverse of a number. The while loop will get repeated as long as the value of n is greater than 0. The variable d is used to extract the last digit and n is used to find the quotient after the division of the number n divided by 10. And the new reverse will successively get calculated into the variable rev. Once the while loop, loop terminates, the reverse of the variable n will get stored into the variable rev. But after the completion of the while loop, the variable n will become 0. So we compare the actual number which was preserved in the variable num with the reverse rev. If the condition is true, we return the value as true. Otherwise, in the else block, we return the value as false. We are returning the value true to indicate that the number is palindrome. The number is said to be a palindrome if the number and its reverse are the same. If they are not the same in the else block, we return the value as false to indicate that the number is not a palindrome. Outside the function definition, a value from the user has been taken and it gets shown into the variable x. East palindrome method has been called by passing the value x. Now the east palindrome function returns either the value true or false. If it returns the value true, that means the x is a palindrome. As if is palindrome method is returning the value false for the parameter x, then the x is not a palindrome. The output is printed by using the print method. Run and see the program output. During the division of the statement n equal to n divided by 10, there is a specific requirement of type casting. So it should be written with the keyword int. Otherwise, during the division, the value of n will become a floating point number. So the while loop will repeat for an infinite number of times. Run and see the program output.